Guys, I didn't realize just how bad this kit lens is and just how big of an improvement this 50 millimeter OSS prime lens is from the kit lens until I shot some videos and photos of Jamal Rowley. Yeah, don't go, don't go. I just can't come close, come close. I'm looking for the loco, loco. No, I don't want to postpone. So buttery, Smith. So it's really interesting just how fast I've been able to improve in my photography skills. Now, I don't want to be a photographer. I never want to be a photographer, but I, I do believe that I took some pretty dope photos today. <laughs> If you're truly interested in something, you will improve on it so fast because you'll obsess over it. In elementary school, the subjects that I was not interested in, that I was not passionate about, like reading or social studies, I was so slow at those subjects that the, the teachers literally thought that I had a learning disorder. They thought I had a learning disorder. They almost tagged me as special. Things that I was not interested in, I was very slow at progressing and learning at those things, but things that I was interested in, math and science, boom. As I literally knew the names of every single planet in our solar system, I knew what black holes were, I knew what planet X was, I knew about other galaxies and the warping of space time. Like, I knew so much. I was like eight, nine years old, and I knew about black holes and what they did, and I was theorizing about other universes literally at eight years old, yet I could barely read. Guys, the the point is, focus on your strengths, focus on what you're good at, focus on getting really, really good at the things that you're already good at as opposed to getting good at the things that you're probably never going to be good at because it's, it's a waste of time. But anyways, we're here at Target. I need a new food scale. I haven't had a food scale for the past two weeks and it's been really demotivating me. I haven't been dieting that hard because I haven't had a food scale. So we're finally getting a new food scale after three years. I've had the same food scale for three years. <laughs> have not tried kombucha you you need you need to you it's all i need is you so i'm gonna say you need to i just I, I got a little blueberry mint kombucha to end off the day and i just I, it's really good it's really good scale since early 2016. I just got that latest food scale just a couple of days. Actually, that was yes. I lost track of time. This that you're seeing now is two days later. But here's the whole point. These two food scales are symbols. Symbols of how much things have changed over the past two years for me and how much I've cleaned up my videography, my editing, my videos, just how much better things have gotten and how much you can progress in two years. I want to show you guys my first ever b-roll slash if you want to call it even a cinematic edit my first ever clip with music played over it and the video played to the beat my first ever clip compared to my latest cinematic edit that i did for jamal roley oh my god the difference is insane <laughs> in two years.
So I just want to end this video off by saying, go after whatever you want to do. Like, don't wait. Like, the, the, the time to start is now. It's going to take some time, but if you're really passionate about what you're doing and you're really good at what you're doing, you'll get better pretty fast. And you'll really, really enjoy the process of getting better and be like, oh, I'm, I'm, I've learned this, I've learned that, and, and this is getting better, and that's getting better, I'm improving here, I'm improving there. It's just an awesome process, and I would love for you guys to just go for it. Like, don't, don't sit back and watch everybody else, like, go for their dreams. Go for your dreams, too. It, it might take a year, it might take two years, it might take three, four, five, who knows? But the, the thing is, you'll really enjoy the process and you'll really be living life on your own terms. If you're my age, if you're 23 years old, and you don't have a family yet, take some risks. Even if you are a little older and you do have a family, still take some risks. The only thing worse than failing at doing what you want to do is failing at doing what you don't want to do. So go after what you want unapologetically. Go, go get it, guys. With that, I'm going to go ahead and conclude this video all love. I'll see you guys next video. Like if you enjoyed this video. Comment if you have any questions or concerns. I'll see you guys next time.